the strength of a nation's currency is based on the strength of that nation's economy. And the American economy is by far the strongest in the world. Accordingly, I have directed the Secretary of the Treasury to take the action necessary to defend the dollar against the speculators. I directed Secretary Connolly to suspend temporarily the convertibility of the dollar into gold or other reserve assets, except in amounts and conditions determined to be in the interest of monetary stability and in the best interest of the United States. August 15, 1971 will stand as an important event in economic history uh, for many, many uh, generations. In fact, you know, hundreds of years from now, people... And that would be a perfect segue in the sand. Yo, what's up? Raj coming at y'all. Hope you, every, everybody is super fine. Two people here, two no likes, but it's okay because I know you like me or you wouldn't be here. I want to thank the Heavenly for the opportunity to be able to see you guys. And also pray that uh, we could do what's coming, which is a financial situation. And I had that play because that was something from back in the day when Nixon was talking about getting off the gold standard and putting us on a uh, standard whereas we are... Uh, are pretty much going to be, it's not a gold standard, it's going to be a broke standard. So if you're not yeah, familiar with what's going on right now, it would be a good idea for you to start finding a way to enhance your wealth or what you have. You don't have to be wealthy. Wealthy is being wise with the little bit that you have. That's what wealthy is to me. You don't have to be a zillionaire to be wealthy. There's a lot of people who have millions of dollars, won lotteries and whatsoever, they are broke. People who made bad business decisions. The economy may have took their business out. You know what I mean? It wasn't their fault, but they were millionaires. And all of a sudden, here comes this Wuhan virus, and now all of a sudden, everybody loses their business. You never know. So whatever you have in your hands is your wealth, and you need to protect your wealth. And that's why every morning I talk about fragrances, and I talk about wealth, all right? So let's get right to it. Basilica. I would buy it again and again and again. There's no doubt about it. Woody, aromatic, amber, fresh, spicy, latonic, smoky, balsamic, and warm spicy. Uh, this is from the house of Mass Milano, but they spun off another house like a lot of people are doing. They spin off other houses. Milano Fragrance. This happened in 2020. Of course, Mass Milano was the other house and also have a, a fragrance from that house as well. Uh, so this bad boy right here, like I said, when I first smelled it, I went down to... Perfumology and grabbed it. And I was like, man, I was down there kind of late. I went down there. Well, not late, late. I got in there kind of late, though. I think I came after work or something. I rushed down there. And I walked in, and, and Brian was there. And I was going through. I said, where did these come from? Yeah, there's about seven of them, six or seven. So I got the spray, and I'm like, nah, this joint is popping. But there was another one that was pretty good, too. But this one right here, this, I mean, the heaviness of this bottle, the, they, they should be charging more. I'd be like a buck thirty for a hundred mil of this, man. This this should be two hundred dollars, easy work. Hey, man. Hey, 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 Milano. Don't go around telling people what I said. This fragrance for men and women. This new fragrance, Basilica, was launched in two thousand twenty-one. Notes on this fragrance is Valan Colas. Oh, I gotta look up her, her stuff. Top notes: thyme or thyme and rosemary. Middle notes: incense, milk, lavender, making it nice and smooth for you. And the base notes of Virginia cedar, cypress oil, or nagamatha, and woody notes. And that's what it comes down to. A little thing that was written to go along with that as a, a procure or procure uh, was in, de in the desert basilica, and I made that word up. I'll just say in addition. A cappella singing from a choir echoed by the sheer stone walls. By the side altar, tiny lights of a mini candle warmed up the heart incense and candlelight adorned their aromatic freshness interpreted by Valon Colas, which it is this is based around the incense don't get it twisted don't get think about it. the the thyme the rosemary the milk lavender virginia cedar which kind of helps it uh um uh, uh incense if you if you ask me because i like incense and i like virginia cedar because that's why i bought what's going on aj that's why i bought um LDDM by Andy Tower because I thought it was this. It was actually Virginia Cedar. 
So yeah, the Virginia, the Virginia seed and the incense here probably make this pop. Well, I'll just sip right all. It's all about the incense. The dry down on this is the incense, and it is just I can't spray enough. It's blue. I'm wearing blue. Hey, it's popping. And what? Shut up, Raj. Good thing D News are here because he would have saw me spraying my mouth open. He would he would have wore me out, man. He would you know what I mean. All right, so that's the deal. Basilica, perfumology, grab it, grab two. If I had to buy some over right now, and I've had a lot of juices, I've had many juices throughout my uh, throughout my career in doing fragrance thing, and then I'm bowing out gracefully, but still hanging on just a little bit for you guys. It's too crowded for me to be in there. I I, I, I can't play around, man. I keep it too real. I I won't have a friend in the community, man. If I stay in this community, that's why I do what I do like this, right? And then of course, um. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's just, you know, it's a good investment if you really like fragrances, I mean, but if you're doing it just to get attention, or you, you need something to make you relevant, and start a YouTube channel, or wherever, a social media channel, and the only thing you really can do, could you, this is it, you know, let it be done, because I did it, but I know how to bow out gracefully, and I'm bowing out gracefully, all right, but it's still good for you, if I had to buy one again, it would be this, and it would be La Crema, those would be the two, the last two that I bought would be the Two that I would buy again easily, easily. All right. With that being said, we're gonna talk about this Harias Silver Bar. Mm -hmm. uh, let's get to that. Harias or Harias or Hararius. How do this, this is a Swiss bar company. Uh, they go by the name of Agor. Dot It's a ten ten iron bar. But there's some elements, of course. I'm giving anybody shouts out. Perfumology elements. Bam. And it's kind of rusty when I saw it, like, a, you know, last week. I was like, man, I want that Horaeus bar. I just found out it was a beautiful Swiss bar. Man, I need that. Let's talk about this bar, okay? Besides it being 10 ounce, so it's 10 ounce coins. You've got ounce coins. Just weigh them and put them in your hand. It'll, it'll weigh like this. Now, this is another one of my 10 ounce bars. I'm starting to collect more bars than I am coins because I have too many coins. Or I have enough coins to satisfy me. Now, unless I did see a couple coins that Elements had. I'm like, yo, where get that one from? But... Not, not quite yet. I'm still standing to the bar thing because I think that it'll be more equity for me if I need some dollars real quick. You know what I mean? The economy goes to tanking, and that's probably going to happen somewhere around March, April. Then it'll be easy for me to get some equity back using this instead of using like little coins or 10 coins at a time. I can just use this. I still have my coins. If need be, I got them. But bam. So it's a radius. In the back, you got stamped a radius. Some of most of the bars, they usually stamp the name on the back. Some don't. Some generic bars, you know, they have pictures and all that stuff. All kinds of stuff. I've seen a 10-ounce bar that had a guy named he's retiring. And somebody gave him a 10-ounce bar with his name on it. So a lot, a lot of ways you can get these bars. But this right here is actual company. And it's not as distinctive as, let's say, uh, 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 Englehart or maybe Johnson & Matthew. Or there's some really high-end bop pomp. Make some good bars. Uh, Geiger definitely made some good bars, and all those of which I have except a pamp. And I want to get a pamp, and then I'll probably be close to stopping collecting bars. But I got to get a pamp. I'm not long going to take Elmans or Wayne Coin Shop to get one. They had one, but I missed out on it. So that's what we have. Invest in pure silver with the Horaeus 10 ounce bar from Provident Metals. I didn't buy it from Provident Metals. I'm just reading what they said. Of course, they're going to put the own thing out. These bars are a great way to invest in 999 pure silver. This item is a no-frills investor who puts quality over design, okay, which means they got to have all that stuff on it, blah, 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 a big 10. Now, they have different ones. They have newer. This is an older one. That's why I bought it because it's an older design. The newer one's got, you know, a different inscription. It has a Reyes 999 found silver, and then they have a decal there, mm -hmm. Hanoi, and all that stuff. This one, bada bing, bada boom. This guy trying to holler at me now while I'm doing this video. He's going to have to wait. Okay, let's get back to what we're doing. Talking about some plus shipping. She saw I don't do shipping and now a dog barking. So let me hurry up. Uh, the face of the bar reads, which is not this bar, but it does read 10 Croy ounces, Horaeus 999 foul and silver, but it doesn't have a logo like it's here. All right. And the reverse shows a repeated pattern of Horaeus. Silver makes an excellent store of wealth. We just talked about that. And it's a proven way to stave off inflation. Just talked about that. By securing private minute silver bars, you'll be protecting your family with an investment that has held this value over years and years. And again, the dollar's not worth anything now. The dollar might be worth 25 cents because they're cheapening the food that you buy to try to make it look like your money getting 
more than what it's supposed to get, but you just buying bad food with bad money. And that's what it is. About Horaeus Edelmetel, okay? Horaeus is a prestigious private mint based in Hanoi, Germany. Okay, I thought it was Swiss. Hanoi, Germany. Well, Swiss is in Germany, right? I don't know. Switzerland, Germany? I don't know. It has been operating for more than 160 years and has a reputation for excellence. It offers extremely pure silver bars, but also produces gold and platinum. Horaeus offices are located in Hanoi, uh, Germany, Hong Kong, China, Shanghai, China, New York, and United States. In the United States, Horaeus bars and rounds, so they make rounds as well, probably one ounce rounds, are uh, frequently included with the logo depicting the hands holding three roses. This one doesn't. It is drawn from the family crest, created by Isaac Horaeus, the uh, an apothecary who lived from 1636 to 1676. Dang, he didn't live long, right? Wow, he didn't live 40 years. And I'm out. Remember, smell good. It's not the most important thing, but you never know. People don't, never know. They'll do business with you if you're not smelling decent. And if you want to do business with a bar, you need something to eat, or you, you, can, probably, you can probably get somebody a car for this. If it really, really got bad, and somebody really needs something to eat, I say, well, I'll, I'll take your hoopty. I'll give you this for your hoopty. Now, this is 10 ounces. An ounce of silver costs $23 today, $23.31. Gold is up banging, man. I might take another piece of gold over here, man. Gold is up 1837. And I got a couple of pieces of gold, man. I gotta go, man. Talk to y'all later. Be well. Juices, silver, precious metals, gold, platinum, whatever you want to buy. Palladium. If you're really a baller, you'll buy some rhodium. You know, and you're good to go. All right, I gotta go. Take care of yourself. Be well. And uh, I pray that you have a super duper day. All right, talk to you soon. Heaven willing. And I'm out. Like, subscribe, share my channel, share, ba 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 ba, you know, the whole thing everybody said. Holla.